So today I've got for you a Love Every unboxing. Um, for those of you who don't know what Love Every is, it's a toy subscription box and it comes every three months. I have got the assistant reviewer here with me who's going to help me review and unbox. So, um, yeah, so you get these every three months and it goes according to the stage your child's at, um, depending on their age. And, um, so yeah, I mean, I've been wanting to get these for a little while and but the only thing was that it was in america only and now it's come to europe we've actually ordered it for ishika and um sorry i'm just gonna grab her off yep that's it come here um and so yeah this one is the babbler play kit it's for 13 months to 15 months she is currently 12 months but we've ordered the one just ahead um because i just preferred that one and i didn't want the 11 to 12 month one um, so I think there is an option to sk skip boxes and things, but from one year onwards, it does get a bit more expensive. Um, so let me just start the unboxing now, if I can get this one off the box. Here we go. Hold on, Ishika. Hold on. We need to open this. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here, sweetie. Whoops. Uh, okay, so it's got this big card and it tells you all of the activities that you get. So, first of all, we've got this little book called Bedtime for Zoe, which is very apt because we have problems with bedtime with Ishika. So, this is her. She likes books. Would Daddy open her pages for her, please? She's off on the next set already. Hmm. <gasps> She loves turning pages, so she's probably going to just keep turning the pages. We have these, which are one of the things that I really like about Love Every. It's the play guide, so it will tell, tell us about how to play with each of these toys with our children. Um, so we've got, we've got a timeline for introducing play things. Then we've got different instructions and different um, guidance on your child and their age. And I'm just trying to find all the activities. Hold on. Okay, so this is like one of the activities. So it's got the planting, posting and picking carrots. And it's a box with things that you need to put in. So I think it's a carrot. And it tells you basically how and why to do this. So I think this is along the lines of the instructions. Um, as we can see, someone can't wait to get stuck in. So next we have this puzzle, I think it's called. Um, this is the puzzle. And it's I think it's three, it's like loads of circles and they just have to fit them into the right one. And the next thing we have is this box which is for full of carrots i think so she has to put the carrots in this hole um i think the, the box has like three different lids so this one is for some coins which i think will be in there as well the third lid which is i think you can use um your own sort of items in there like cotton buds and things and they have to learn to put them as you go put this in there and then we've got this this um felt burrow thing which has three little bunnies and they're supposed to learn to put them inside there right now she's more interested in the balls <laughs> someone's trying to find the ball Well done, Ishiga! And the last item is this uh, stacking puzzle. Um, so this, I think you're supposed to stack the right colours on different uh, circles. 